commemorating the World Press Freedom Day that falls today, the United Nations has called for a better protection of journalists, especially those in the environment beat. In this year's commemoration of the World Press Freedom Day, the United Nations took a main theme called A Press for the Planet, Protecting Journalists and Scientists in Defense of the Environment. Secretary General of the United Nations, Antonio Guterres, said in a statement on Thursday that people around the world should know that the world was facing an environmental emergency situation that had never occurred before. The situation, he said, posed a real threat to both current and future generations. Guterres said everyone needs to know about such dangers, and the UN believes that journalists and other media workers have an important role to educate the masses. He points out that local or nationwide and global media can highlight news about climate crisis, the loss of biodiversity and environmental unfairness that has become an important issue currently. Is under siege. Through the role of the media, Guterres says people can understand the suffering of the planet Earth and they can be mobilized and empowered in order to be able to take an action for the sake of change. In addition, journalists can capture stories about environmental degradation, which can provide any evidence of environmental vandalism to enable authorities to seek the culprits. The United Nations recognizes the invaluable work of journalists and media professionals to ensure that the public is informed and engaged. Without facts, we cannot fight mis- and disinformation. Without accountability, we will not have strong policies in place. Without press freedom, we won't have any freedom. A free press is not a choice, but a necessity. Our World Press Freedom Day is very important. And so I call on governments, the private sector and civil society to join us in reaffirming our commitment to safeguarding press freedom and the rights of journalists and media professionals around the world. Reporting on environmental issues. And the frequency of Guterres said currently the freedom of the press is still under siege and environmental journalism is a profession which faces more dangers, including in its relations with other global issues such as the war in Gaza, Palestine. Guterres hopes that journalists can move together forward to educate and focus on solutions of the issues they reported. He also calls for governments, the private sector and common citizens to re-emphasize the importance of the freedom of the press and journalists' rights.